Okay, so the moment you've all been waiting for, was it worth it? Hi guys, it's Jen, your workout guide through New York City, and I'm here to tell you all about rumble boxing. I'm going to walk you through the workout itself, the amenities, the schedule and location, the price of course, and in the end, I will let you know if I think it was worth it. If you're new, I'm obsessed with taking workout classes. I live in New York City, I work full time, I wanna live a healthy lifestyle. If you feel the same, stick around, subscribe, and let's get into my review on Rumble. Okay, so what is Rumble? What is the workout? Rumble says that their workout is 10 rounds of fire that you can make as challenging as you like. So there's two parts to that. The first part is the 10 rounds of fire, which is the workout. So I'm gonna take you step by step through what the class is. So the first five minutes before class even starts, they do an overview of the class and they review all of the six punches. So if you have never taken boxing in your life and you don't even know what a jab or an uppercut is, they take you through all of them, they show you what your footwork should be like, and they make it really clear and simple. And after that, they turn the music up, they turn the lights down, and you do a few minutes of cardio. So you'll do a bunch of jump squats, jumping jacks, some sit-up action, and then we get into punching on the back. On the bag, you have three rounds. Each round is just a different combination of punches on the back. You have rest between each round. Then you go to the other side of the studio, which you'll see right here, which is what they call the floor. So there are a bunch of benches and dumbbells set up for you. You go to your bench and there's another three rounds on the floor. So the floor is for strength and conditioning. and You use dumbbells and then sometimes just your own body weight with things like burpees. You're three rounds on the floor and between each round you have active recovery. So as he's showing you the moves for the next round, you're jogging in place. So the good thing about all of these rounds on the bed and on the floor is there's a screen above. So you don't just have to remember what the instructor told you or look around to the people next to you because it's also written on the screen. So they'll show you exactly what you're doing before you do it, but then you can read it up on the screen. So for the bag, it'll say like one, two, five, six, and then also under one, two, five, six, it'll remind you what each punch is. And then on the floor, it'll say 10 arm raises, 10 these, 10 burpees, whatever. Don't have to look around, you can be in your own space, go at your own pace. Okay, so then you do your two final rounds. They're called the power rounds. So they're really high paced. There's some freestyling in there so you can do anything you want and that's the fun part. Then you do your final two rounds on the floor which focuses on abs and arms. Then you do some stretching and that's the end of the workout. So it's a 45 minute class and it goes by really, really fast. So the second part of Rumble's definition is that you can go at whatever pace is challenging for you. Like I mentioned before, the lights are dark. Do not feel like anyone's watching you at all because it's dark and you're really in the zone. They play hip hop and house music really, really loud. I honestly thought there was a DJ and then I learned it was just a really good, really good uh, like nightclub sound system. And the punching bags are filled with water. Okay, the amenities. So, I visited the NoHo location, so in these clips that we've been showing you, it's gonna be the NoHo location in New York City. So there were full locker rooms. Every locker had one of those built-in locks, so you don't have to bring one. They had towels, they had such nice showers with dry bar shampoo, conditioner, face wash, body wash, and they had dry bar, dry shampoo, hairspray, they had deodorant, blow dryers, they had it all. And one thing really important to note, which is something I always look at in studios, is there were people cleaning the bathrooms and the studio at all times. When I went back into the studio after the class to get some footage for you guys, you can see people are already cleaning the studio because they have a class every single hour. They make sure that it is clean for every single new group of people that comes in. I really enjoyed using the showers and getting ready for work. I took an 8 a.m. class and then I showered, did my hair, did my makeup. There was like seven girls in there and there was ample space. It was beautiful. For a boxing studio, I did not expect that. They sell apparel, they sell the wrap gloves, they sell the boxing gloves. The wrap gloves are $8 and then you keep them after. Okay, now let's go on to schedule and location. So they have a few in New York City. They have Upper East Side, they have NoHo, and then they have Flatiron slash Chelsea. In LA, they have one in West Hollywood, and in San Francisco, they have one. I looked at the schedules for each studio. They all have a class every single hour. Okay, let's go on to prices. 
New York, you have a first time deal two for one. So one class is 36. If you're a new client, you can get two classes for $36. A private is 175. In LA, you get that same deal, but one class is $32. And in San Francisco, you get the same deal, but for $34. So the package savings are all the same. If you get the five class package from any city, you save $5. If you do the 10 class package, you actually save $20. The private in New York is 175 and they're a little less in LA and San Francisco. Okay, so the moment you've all been waiting for, was it worth it? Was the price worth it? Was the trip worth it? Was it worth it to wake up early before work and do that? Yes, yep. Yeah. In my opinion, if I'm gonna spend nearly $40 on a class, it better be worth it. In New York City, $36 is not that out of the norm, but it's definitely on one of the more expensive ends of a workout class. But in just 45 minutes, you get HIT, which is high intensity interval training, strength training, metabolic conditioning, metabolic, whatever you, cardio. And also for me, boxing is a lot of self-care. Such a good way to get out your aggression on anything that's bothering you in your life. It just feels so good to have that moment to yourself, just punch everything that's frustrating you out. You don't have your phone, the lights are off, the music's pumping, that's worth it for me. Well, 100% go back. The instructors were so clear, motivating, encouraging, and it wasn't culty at all because it's a fairly new studio. It wasn't that intimidating to walk into, okay? And that's it. Give this a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Let me know if you like Rumble, and I will see you guys next week. And now, I feel like a boxer.